This latest finding surprised scientists, one of the world's most complex and dangerous volcanic calderas, are once again in the spotlight of scientists. Located west of Naples, Italy, this area has long been known as a dormant volcano with the potential for a major eruption in the future. In recent months, a series of new discoveries have surprised volcanologists and raised concerns among local residents. This video takes a deep look at recent developments in the region, including more than 135 seismic events recorded in the past week alone. This activity indicates the movement of hot fluids beneath the surface, a classic sign of increased pressure in a magmatic system. More than just numbers, this data reflects the complex dynamics between magma, volcanic gases, and the Earth's crust beneath this densely populated city. One of the most striking indicators of this recent activity is the increase in temperatures at the main fumaroles, particularly Pisciarelli and Bacca Grande. The latest data shows that the temperature of the escaping gases has reached 170 degrees Celsius, the highest value recorded in the last decade. This increase in temperature indicates not only increased underground pressure, but also chemical changes in the composition of the escaping gases, suggesting possible closer interaction with the shallow magma chamber. Researchers from the Osservatorio Vesuviano, the world's oldest volcanic monitoring institute, have warned that these subtle changes in gas release patterns could signal that the volcanic system is in a readjustment phase. While there are no signs of an imminent major eruption, this process indicates that the caldera is becoming more active than in previous years. One of the most visible impacts of this underground activity can be seen on Via Antiniana, a main street in Pozzuoli. Here, the asphalt appears to be blistering and cracking under the pressure of steam rising from underground. This is not the first time this phenomenon has occurred, and it presents a serious challenge for local authorities. Urban infrastructure above active hydrothermal systems like Campi Flegrei faces unique risks. The ground can suddenly heave, collapse, or even crack due to the accumulation of gases. Local authorities and engineers now face a dilemma between maintaining public safety and maintaining economic activity in densely populated areas. Monitoring of ground temperature, levels of toxic gases such as CO2 and H2S, and surface deformation is now carried out almost hourly to anticipate sudden changes. More than 500,000 people live in areas directly affected by this volcanic activity. For them, increased seismic and geothermal activity is not just a scientific phenomenon, it is a daily reality that creates anxiety and uncertainty. In many schools, emergency evacuation drills are now being held, while local governments continue to update contingency plans in case volcanic activity increases to a higher alert level. However, many residents consider these warnings excessive given that Campi Flegri has shown similar signs since the 1980s without erupting. This debate highlights the societal challenge facing scientists and governments, how to balance preparedness and public reassurance. New technology now allows researchers to monitor this caldera with unprecedented precision. With INISAR satellites and high-precision GPS sensors, even a few millimeters of ground rise can be detected. This data shows that in the past two years, the Pozzuoli area has experienced about 15 centimeters of ground uplift, indicating pressure from below due to the accumulation of gas or shallow magma. Field laboratories around the fumaroles also continuously measure changes in the concentration of volcanic gases such as CO2, SO2, and H2O. The chemical ratios between these gases provide important clues about the depth and heat source driving this activity. Recent analyses indicate that the heat source is rising to shallower layers, strengthening the hypothesis that the Campi Flegre hydrothermal system is boiling. The Flegrean fields are a living natural laboratory, a place where science, history, and human life interact daily. In this video, we'll explore how Italian and international scientists are collaborating to understand the breadth of this caldera. You will also see how local communities are adapting to the reality of living atop one of the most dangerous volcanic systems in Europe. Is Campi Flegre heading into a new eruptive phase, or is it simply releasing its internal pressure after hundreds of years of slumber? The answer remains a mystery, but one thing is certain. Every tiny tremor, 
Every rise in temperature and every crack in the asphalt is part of a long story of humanity's relationship with the immeasurable forces of nature.